Weapon number 1, The Power of Voice Addressing Iblis, Almighty Allah declared. Use your voice to entice whosoever you can. Explaining the word voice, the Mufasirin have written that Almighty Allah had vested Iblis with the power to distract, tempt and trap man through the usage of music, musical instruments, items of play and amusement and through the power of waswasa, blowing thoughts into the heart and minds of man. 3. The venue for the final match between man and Iblis had, from the very beginning, been said to be the Suma. Being the final match Almighty Allah had allowed the opening up of that level of power to the Shayatin and the Suma which they had never enjoyed previously. The voice of Iblis has today reached such levels that there is hardly a soul who does not hear this voice, in some manner or the other, on a daily basis. This voice, through the medium of the television, newspaper, advertisements, cartoons, movies, etc., filters through the minds and hearts of millions every second, yet few are aware of whose voice they are actually hearing. When one listens to music, he is not merely hearing some musician, but rather he is being captivated by the tunes and messages of Shaitan. When a child is entertained with cartoons, he is not just hearing Donald. 3 As mentioned by Kurtubi and his staff seer, a homilker and duck and goofy, but rather through the tongue of cartoon characters, he is being poisoned by the speech of Shaitan. Iblis allows no stage of man to pass except that he converses and interacts with him, her according to the mental level of the individual, be it through cartoons, novels, magazines, newspapers, soaps, movies, etc. Almighty Allah afforded Shaitan this amazing power of voice, and he, Shaitan, has left no stone unturned in utilizing this power of deceit to its full. Had there been no continuous shower of Almighty Allah's grace in every era, known as topic divine guidance, this voice of Iblis alone would have been sufficient to entice mankind in entirety into the worship of the jinn. Yet, despite this amazing tool of voice and the power it contains, instead of finding Masajid emptying by the day, we are witnessing the building of new Masajid due to the ones present no longer being sufficient to accommodate the crowds flocking towards it. From the very beginning, Almighty Allah had announced that Shaitan's efforts shall fail and that in every era there shall surely be at least a few servants of Almighty Allah who shall remain firm upon the truth till the very end, no matter how fierce the Shaitani attack may be, but Shaitan, in his stubbornness, refused to pay heed.